My last item. Check these out. Oh. Yeah. What up, Rep Bag? It's your boy here, King Reptar. Back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. And if you guys are, you know that drill. Camera rotate to the side. The side, partner. Side flip. That's just not really satisfying. I, I, Camera I, flip! <laughs> there we go. Sad. Yeah, that's much better. Sorry I asked for that. I'll never do that again. But today, guys, we are going to be doing a mystery box challenge. If you guys don't know what that is, in the last video, me and Parker and Conscious, we had two boxes just like these. I forgot to get the boxes, so. Just like these PNGs. <laughs> these boxes right here, these ones right here. It's weird, my box is bigger. It's blacker. Oh, and cooler. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that, that, your box sucks. <laughs> All right, so, what we're gonna be doing though is in the last video, we went to the mall. Where, you know, the mall? You know, especially in Brea, you go to the mall, the prices aren't super, super high, but the money's definitely there. You definitely gotta spend a couple, couple, couple hundo, okay? But, today, we're going to the poor store. Uh, <laughs> we're going to Goodwill. Whoa. Goodwill? No, no. We're, 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 we live in Beverly Hills, Malibu, Malibu. No. No, we're going to Dollar Tree. Oh, <laughs> so, in this challenge, guys, we will have to get all this stuff in our mystery boxes from exclusively Dollar Tree, Five Below, or any other 99 cent store or dollar type store we can find. Because sometimes you can get some pretty cool items for a dollar that just happen to be there. But our goal is to try and make the most fun and the most interesting and the coolest and the funnest mystery box. <laughs> Box. They can have Naruto, Spongebob, Pokemon, anything at all that we think is interesting to put in the box for you guys. And you guys at home will decide who won this challenge. So, we're gonna go to Dollar Tree right now, and the budget is... This is like having $100,000 and living in Delaware. You have $100 oh for, for Dollar Tree and Five Below. <laughs> Right, now let's just go. Come on. Wait, you know we have to do stuff before we leave. You can't just walk out the door every single yeah, time. Okay, come on. Let me no, no, up but no. Somebody else clean it up. Uh, who else was? No, there's nobody else. Daisy cleaned it up. What? She got it. Okay, she is very, 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 very dependable. All right, guys, we just got here at Dollar Tree, and we're also at Five Below. <laughs> Actually, that is so freaking convenient. So, it happens to be a Dollar Tree and a Five Below. This is the first ones we're going to go through. We're going to go in there, see what kind of fun, interesting stuff we can have to add to our box. We're going to be shopping separately, and then we're going to go back and unbox the boxes. All right, guys, so we just got out of the Five Below and the Dollar Tree. To be honest, that Five Below was definitely on the below side. <laughs> right here, we have two bags from Dollar Tree and two from Five Below. One bag's mine and one is Parker from both different stores. I'm not going to say that I'm jealous or anything, but I, I noticed that somebody found something, something at Dollar Tree. But Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> we're not going to look there yet. All right, so we're going to go to that next Dollar Tree. Then we're going to go back, fill those boxes up, and we're going to get into them. We, we can see you. We, All right, Rep Pack. Wait, so, wait, we wait, just wait. got back from the Dollar Tree. Yeah, well, we know that. Like, why'd you, why, this isn't a Casey Neistat video. Why are you, why are you <laughs> trying to pretend like this is like we were just walking in for the first time? The lights are on. Everything's set up. Okay, it's a different day. <laughs> yeah, it's look, the look next here. day. We went to Dollar Tree. went to Five Below. All the Dollar Tree leaves have been plucked. And they are all in these boxes. So, what we're going to do is we're going to have three categories. We're going to have food slash fun and stuff to eat. And the second round is the fun and activities round, which means it has to be fun, you have to be active, okay? So that means anything that's a toy related, anything for entertainment, something that we think is cool. And the final round is miscellaneous, which will basically be anything that doesn't fit those other two categories and something we thought was perfect for the rep pack. And you guys will decide who made the better mystery box here using only Dollar Tree and five below. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do it first. I will go cutting, or you know what? You can go first, okay? Give me the, the pleasure of grabbing the shaft of a Milwaukee unboxing knife. That's not the shaft. <laughs> And a little hand goes, okay. <laughs> all right, so Parker's gonna bust his box open and he's gonna show you all the food slash fun to eat things to eat and you guys will decide who had better food items. I'm telling you guys, you'll be surprised with the awesome stuff you're able to find there. All right, so here's Parker's box. Go ahead, I'm gonna give you the pleasure, also the pleasure of cutting it open with that sharp ass knife of yours right there. Mine, mine, my, my knife right there. <laughs> Like margarine. It's thinner than butter. But come on, you're making it more difficult than it has to be. <laughs> All right, so let's see what we got here. So I actually got ended up getting two drinks. Two drinks? Two drinks. Okay. Well, because was it one dollar? There was there was two drinks or fifty cents, or was it two drinks that you paid one dollar individually for? Math isn't my strong suit. <laughs> Both of them I paid a dollar for. Ooh, sounds like a ripoff. <laughs> so the first one everybody remembers. <laughs> Oh my oh. god! What is this, a three liter? This is what you buy for your kids if you don't love them. <laughs> <laughs> 
You get this much liquid for 97 cents and you think this is something you should put in your body? Uh, that wasn't the question. Was <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so then my second drink. Again, guys, you gotta remember this is a dollar, so we got a Shasta soda. And the second one, even your grandparents are gonna remember this. Okay. My grandparents are much older than The Simpsons. <laughs> They, they, they might have somebody, you know. Have you guys seen The Simpsons? Anybody seen The Simpsons around here? I don't know. Never heard of it. <laughs> you got the Duff Energy Drink. <laughs> All right, that's awesome that you even found a novelty item at a Dollar Tree. So I'll give you some credit for that one. Oh yeah. So the food item, just gonna pull it all up, all out at once. Dang, dude, it seems like you got, it sounds like you're grabbing a big stack. Pizza. Yeah. I saw pizza, Logan. <laughs> what do they sell? Individual slices at Dollar Tree? Look at this. We got a pizza and a 100% tasty all gummy burger pizza. What, dude? That is actually dope. This thing looks just like a Big Mac or something. For real, dude. <laughs> Raindrops and drop tops. <laughs> and I'm icing your pizza like a, like a hot box. <laughs> oh, the cherry flavor. The, oh, yeah, number one. Yeah, so if you ever want to pop a cherry in your mouth, you got one right there. All right, so what do we got here? All right, so we're gonna do the hundred percent tasty because that <laughs> I want I want to be hundred percent satisfied. That seems like a hundred percent false appetite. That's a plastic bottom. Damn, I'm not gonna lie though. Where's my bun? <laughs> <laughs> you don't even get a bottom bun. <laughs> Where's my drink? <laughs> oh man, god damn, you got that <laughs> five guys. <laughs> All right, let's see the review on the pizza. Italian cuisine. <laughs> That looks disgusting, dude. Why did it look like Vietnamese pho flavor? That doesn't look like, like threw up all over my pizza. Yeah, it doesn't look like pizza at all. These look like larvae on the side. <laughs> I'm, gonna do, I'm gonna put some goddamn icy squeeze on it. Oh, some marinara? <laughs> yeah, I didn't even think about that. Yeah. Grab <laughs> this. I don't know, man. It's a pizza. You fold it, everybody eats a different. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Well, all right, great. All right, so now it's my turn. And I'll show you how to use the unboxing knife. All right, go, go, go. Those are those already open. What? You didn't say like, anything. Yeah. <laughs> I don't have any drinks. I do not have any drinks. You don't have any drink. What are you gonna watch that with? I'll take some of your shadows. <laughs> Let's go ahead. And I'm just gonna pull out some of the candies I got. Boom. First off, smog balls. Oh, I got these. You wanna know why? Why? Yeah. What the heck? Is Subliminal for? branding. Yeah. <laughs> I got them because I was like, man, they must be really sour if the only comparison they have is tar and cancer sticks. <laughs> and then I got some gummy stuff too, okay? Oh, yeah, okay. I didn't get nothing with no buns. I was thinking outside the bun like Taco Bell told mama, and I got a taco. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, well, I mean, it looks like Jack in the Box stuff. That's just low quality taco. The Jack in the Box just grease grilled into a pocket. <laughs> <laughs> and then next, you got the duck beer. I went for Homer Simpson himself. It's not really, it's not really beer, but energy drink. This right here, I got a pink oh, donut, a gummy donut. That looks freaking it actually looks pretty good. One item I went in the store and did not expect to find was something to add to my collection and also something to eat, and that is... Check them out. Oh! <laughs> the SpongeBob 20 year anniversary right here, they released these giant Krabby Patty gummies. You guys know those ones, those small ones you can rip open and just enjoy those little tiny ones? They're giant ones! Dude, that is sick. <laughs> Just one more thing. You ever been looking for the perfect man? Okay. No. You're not gonna leave the perfect man for a dollar. No, that, that's not okay. You know, that's not that's not me. I mean, you, maybe you can teach me some stuff for a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> the perfect man. <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. <laughs> a man with white features with with black skin. <laughs> Five bullets is the perfect man. <laughs> Oh, mahogany god on a Zac Efron body. <laughs> you wanna know the best thing though, dude? You ever watch the show Two and a Half Men? Oh yeah. You know the Half Man? Half there Man. There is no Half Man. There is a Half Man. He's actually the serving size for this. <laughs> <laughs> oh serving my size. god. Half Man. I told you, man. <laughs> Let's try these out. Okay, so first one up, Smog Balls. These are sour freaking balls right here. Oh jeez, what the are you smoking yet? <laughs> it's like sour cigarettes. Pretty good though. I, oh, that doesn't sound good. That's my teeth breaking. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then next up, we got the freaking gummy taco. Check this thing out, dude. <laughs> that shell is not real. It's not real. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Why does your ingredients have stress marks? <laughs> oh. Mm. Mm. oh. Mm. Ah, somebody passed the fire sauce. <laughs> Disgusting. <laughs> I'm not even eating this donut, dude. Oh, eating. come on. You gotta eat it. The I top is like Patrick's head. <laughs> I'm oh. I'm done. And now for the perfect man. <laughs> All right. For now, for the Krabby Patties, let's see what we got here. These things are freaking huge, dude. Oh, my God. We all remember these. <laughs> that is gigantic. Dude, like Squidward. <laughs> <laughs> it's like an actual slider. Oh my. Oh. oh. <laughs> Can't tell if that's one giant pickle or one giant lettuce. <laughs> I think it's both. <laughs> oh, best thing on the table. That's a damn sure. All right. You guys want to know who won the food round? Next item. All right. So now we're going to get into the his box again, but this is the entertainment round. Are you ready? What? 
For fun, entertainment, you find something entertaining? Yeah. All right, let's see it. <laughs> All right, so what's your first toy slash entertainment item? All right, imagine something entertaining and fun that you can describe in two words. Ass hair. Oh. <laughs> is that fun? Oh. <laughs> what is that then? Brett Favre. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was my cologne. <laughs> my super, super Bowl touchdown pass. All right, the next thing, featured in Fast and Furious. All nine of them. Okay, wow, that's what is Vin Diesel. And Jesus. everybody in their life has seen one. It is freaking exclusive, limited edition, fast, and don't forget stylish. Okay. Here we put on the Tokyo Drift music. All right. <laughs> what is this? This is I, the greatest thing you've ever seen. That looks like if I use strength on it, it a mule might be under there. Okay? <laughs> that looks like those trucks you see in like documentaries about China. Like, <laughs> oh, come on. Where do these stupid ass toys at? <laughs> what is no, this? Give him a chance. Give him a Hello. My name's Little Brian. I'm the king. Get your ass out of here. <laughs> Next thing that's not Brian, because that guy, he's supposed to watch the raw bird. Yeah, stand you, Brian. You Brian. All right, what's next? All right, next is a classic. Classic. A childhood classic. <laughs> you don't remember these, and I don't want to know you. Damn. I don't want to know you either. These are epic. <laughs> if you had an older brother or a sister, your skin remembers them. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> what use could you possibly ah, did you have for this? I'll show you. Okay. When you gotta smack them upside the head, let them know whose side they on. <laughs> All right, what I want you to do is I want to see you grab that Dollar Tree receipt with the smack in. That's what I used to do with them. See if you could do it. I was really good. Wow, that was incredible. <laughs> is that everything? No. What else is there? All right, so you have one more item? One more item. And All this right. last item, it's not even like a, it's a toy, technically. But you know what it really is? It's an investment. An, inve an investment of, it's okay, an what investment. is it? <laughs> so, right here is the gateway to our future. Is it a gun? <laughs> it's not right. this. Is Roche de Tresor. Rusty de Treasure? <laughs> Inside of this rock, you, you excavate it, you dust it off, you chip it right, and then there could be a possibility of a diamond. A diamond? It's a just a rock. Diamond? It just says rock. No, uh, one rock, but there's it's inside there. You have okay, to well, let's it. see this diamond then. Okay. Oh, yeah. Are you serious? This is gonna take forever. Oh, my God. This is gonna be going outside. We'll find this diamond. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Yes. No, Let's find the diamond. No, no, no. <laughs> Where's the diamond at? What the, I don't know. Oh, I found it. What is it? What? It's a sphinx. Wait, you said it was going to be a diamond. Oh my, you just blew everything up. The only thing you got out of this was a donation to the Goodwill. <laughs> Alright, like I said. Alright, so I went a little bit ham, I'd say, in the entertainment category. So first off, I got this. You know what this is? Something breakable. It's very <laughs> but this is an aerial Beyblade. Pretty sure that's a flying propeller with LED. Oh wait, no, it says Arian Beyblade. Oh. <laughs> okay, let's just try it outside. Hopefully another race happens. Aerial Beyblade! Three, two, one, let it fly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know, we all got performance. I think I maybe pulled it a little too hard. <laughs> Last try. Wow. Ooh. That was wow. floating for, for a bit. I'm, I'm going to call that one Apollo. We're going to <laughs> yeah, that was a big bust. I saw that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Next item. This I just got because I wanted it. It's a SpongeBob Hollering book, but it's got this little maze in the front that nobody in under any. You couldn't be the most smart man in the world and you couldn't figure this out. Huh. Where, where's all the color? That color book doesn't have color. That would be a magazine, Parker. <laughs> <laughs> but next, I got... They said they didn't have any uh, inflatables, so I got this. <laughs> <laughs> got a sponge mermaid. It apparently glows in the dark, but I got this because it says grows up to 60, 600, not 60, 600 percent. Dude, same. You do that. I don't know, but <laughs> I'm sure it's not true. That is a fact that you are making up for gain. <laughs> I think it's just this one. I got this one. Oh and I got this one, oh Patrick my. Star. Did this you one. Raid the whole. Oh, what's this the... one. This one. Oh, that's not. That's not that. That's pretty cool. That's the top though. What? See that? Okay, that's that's kind of. Sweet. It's a demo, so I don't have to take my top out. <laughs> and I got yeah. this one, this parrot, and I also got this reptar, T Rex, dinosaur, alligator. He just raided the grow section. That are these all your toys? They say it's not all of them, but it says add to water, and we're gonna go add these to water. All. Of them. All right. So I'm gonna drop all of them in here. Here we go. I don't... <laughs> no, no zebra. Okay. He's been forgotten anyway. Oh, damn! <laughs> it says over the next few days, your creature will grow up to 600% of its original size. That's uh, not gonna be fast. Bag really takes four hours. What? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, for my final item. Let me show one. Okay, well, second to last item. <laughs> you ever heard of silly putty? Of course. How about goofy putty? <laughs> <laughs> I just got that for that. Is there, wow. <laughs> but my last item. Check these out. Oh. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah, you think, oh, Squirtle. Squirtle's pretty cool to get for a dollar. But what if I told you oh. I got an entire Whoa. generation? <laughs> well, that means you got three of the generation. Oh, Pokemon Yellow's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> right there. Got all this for a dollar, guys. We just freaking complete a set rep pack right there. One five dollar bill you got a collection, baby. And the last item. You, you, why do you keep saying everything's the last item? This isn't, this is an item. This is a substance, what? all right? The world's biggest Smarties. What the hell? <laughs> Those are huge. Those aren't smarties. Those are brilliant. <laughs> all right, guys. That is it for all the toys entertainment stuff. Except for we have one little twist eye that we're going to make into a mini challenge right now. All right, guys. So the next part, this is attachment to the toys entertainment round. This is not a Pokemon card video. So we're going to be going through this very, very quick. So happens to find at Dollar Tree, Parker found an entire box of Cosmic Eclipse Dollar Tree packs. There's like 50 in here, right? Yeah, there's about somewhere around there's there. There's like exactly 50 in here. So that is right there and then i found at the five below they actually had boom right there full size Ooh. booster packs for five dollars each a little bit high but we found them at a five below so what we're gonna be doing right here is this is fifty dollars of dollar tree packs how many things you get to open uh, <laughs> oh yeah and this is fifty dollars of pokemon regular packs which one's gonna be the better value so what we're gonna do is we're gonna bust all of these packs open but only show the bangers because like i said this is not a pokemon card video we're just trying to see what the value is what would be better to get for 50 bucks if you had it to just throw 50 bucks on pokemon cards which is a better buy we're gonna see which one has the best pulls all right so we opened all the packs i opened 10 packs and only two of them had white code cards you do not know what's in them yet i just checked to see the cards and parker just see to check to see if he saw any shine and there's five packs that happen okay so open these ones two first let's see which one has better pulls for 50 bucks all right all right execute helotile meowth nidoran larvitar persian the rare oh pikachu and zekrom this is a 50 dollar pikachu <laughs> Let's see what the next one has. All right, Grimer is Cosmog, Litten, Grimer, Execute, Weedle, and Dragonite Hollow. <laughs> All right, first Dollar Tree pack. The card is right in the middle, so we're just gonna go for it. Phantom and okay, Rosa Hollow. When you're paying a buck, a Hollow is a buck. All right, Chin Chow and Dusk Door Hollow. Okay, oh, yeah. okay, oh, you yeah. got the Hollow. Those pass the rare Steelix Hollow. You got better pools, I think. I mean, I had the one GX, but this is three Hollow. That's three hits and the rare. Ooh. <laughs> now you got better pulls from the Dollar Tree pack. It seems like Dollar Tree is your best bet. All right, and then the Trap Pinch and the Rare. <laughs> Two yeah. trader cards. I think the better lesson here is just don't buy Pokemon cards at cheap stores. <laughs> All right, so this is the last round. This is just some like, you know, miscellaneous odds and ends we were able to find that we thought was good. So what do you got? I only have a couple of things in this round. Okay. So one of the things I got, well, apparel. <laughs> apparel. <laughs> well, I got, well, I got a shirt. Okay, well, you got well, a shirt. You got a shirt. At where Dollar Tree or Five Below? This is at Five Below. Okay, yeah, makes more sense. Yeah. <laughs> not only they sell shirts at Dollar Tree, but <laughs> kind of sums up our attitude, you know. So. Okay. I mean, that's funny, but I mean, I think it could be, I don't know, like the underlines are a little weird. Is that even the right size? Like, I don't know about that shirt, man. What are you? What are you, what are you laughing about? Are you listening to me? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's funny how you think you have a shirt. Okay. <laughs> This is my last item. Okay. This is, in my opinion, the dopest thing. Okay, well, I mean, yeah. I'll, I'll be the judge of, I guess you can't be a judge of your opinion, but, <laughs> but I'll be the I'm judge of whether I think it's cool. I'm glad you realized that. <laughs> it was the last one on the shelf. I don't even know if this is like a permanent thing they have, but I think it's like an exclusive find. Just can't wait to unveil it. Okay, what is it? What is it? You're the suspicious killing me. Ooh. It is a Venom. Very bad movie. <laughs> it is a Venom cologne. Venom cologne? Oh, Why would you yeah. want to smell like toxic? Eddie Brock. <laughs> <laughs> I do I want to smell like. I want to smell like carnage. Oh! Hey, that's actually a pretty cheap bottle. <laughs> right in the air. Let's get this scent. I'm going to run through the scent. Damn. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> and you walk by, you're like, what's that? Ooh, and you you like. He shops at five below. Yeah, <laughs> I will say that is odds that you found that. So that is his miscellaneous item. Now, you guys have seen Parker's entire box. Now we're going to be finishing up my box. And we will see whose is the ultimate box from Dollar Tree. All right, guys. So now I have two I have two items for my miscellaneous as well. I saw those shirts as well. And I'm like, okay, you can get a shirt for five bucks. That's going at the box. So I got this shirt because, well, I've lived it. <laughs> yeah. And I also got this! 
right. A SpongeBob shirt. Ooh, I was ahead, so right. stoked to get this. It's a SpongeBob item at five below. You probably fit a large. But I mean, you, you're probably more comfortable on XR. That's not your size. Parker was five below. I got what I could get. <laughs> a very, very important poster. It stays very, very close to the heart and you, with you guys as well. Is yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I saw myself on a poster. Like I gotta have it. That's crazy. That they actually have that poster. That's crazy. They have branded stuff at all. Think about the dollar store. Because even when you take everything out, trash is worth just as much. So that is it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new here. Stop what you're doing. And subscribe right now. Should hit the bell. Turn on post notifications. And right here on your screen is the last mystery box. Go check that video out. We're with more of a high-end version of this challenge. And I'll see you guys over there. And as always, Rep Pack, I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios. Bloop.